There are not many places you can go to get seafood out of a boat that's been converted into a food truck slash caravan It's a food setup. truck boat. Wicked. I mean, who's the only one in New Zealand? It's gotta be. Yeah, it's gotta be. Uh, like, super unique, stacked seafood menu. We're talking crayfish, pawa, mussels, All seafood chowder. All of the chowder. good things. So this is Captain Kaimoana. We're out south in Rose Hill and today, it's all about seafood. It's going to be good. I'm Thomas. And I'm Sheena. And we're chasing a plate. Hope you're hungry. Let's eat. I have ordered up a seafood feast. So, Seafood is kaimoana in Māori. Let me show you what I've got. We've got um, half a crayfish or colder. We've ordered mussels. We've ordered uh, half and half fried. So that's half uh, creamy power and half seafood chowder, I believe. Um, the power smash double cheeseburger. And these guys have also put aside the biggest flounder of the day for us. It's 800 grams. It's a huge beef. This is our jumbo yellow belly. Oh, 800 grams. So, the beast, that's for you guys. It's pretty much all family that work here. That's yeah, we've got my nanny in the kitchen now. She's doing the fry bread. Hi, nanny. Hey, nanny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've jumped into the kitchen, which is out the back of the food truck, and this is fry bread central. Look at the fry bread getting whipped together. Goes in the deep fryer comes out looking like this. Look at that golden deliciousness. Thank you. You've got to try the smash burger. Yeah. You've got to try the crayfish. Um, and do you just want the, the power fries? Yeah, I mean, got it. Like, yeah, if, if you're going <laughs> to if you're going to do it, I reckon go uh, half and half because you get chowder and power on the same fries. Yeah. Here we go, team. Woohoo! Thank you so first much. Bag. First bag. Oh my gosh, it is hefty. Yeah. That crispy tail, check it out. Sweet. <laughs> We have gone all out, so first bag collected, we've got more coming, we are sampling heaps of the menu, knowing we're never going to be able to finish this, we're going for leftovers for dinner tonight, this is lunch today, the smells here, the visuals, this is a cool place. Holy moly, it is a kaimoana extravaganza, we've got so much of the menu here, we've got scallops and fry bread, we've got this giant beast of a pateki or flounder that's just been um, chucked on the hot plate. Mussels and fry bread, uh, chowder, seafood chowder, cream power on fries, extras on the side. We've got half a crayfish and this monster of a burger is loaded, is, uh, loaded with smash patties, cheese, cream power. This place is epic. It totally lives up to its reputation. Usually there are just queues down the road. It's a Fano or family operation, so Nanny inside was making all the fry bread and it is, oh, it's puffy, it's golden, and it smells so good. Let's dive in. I've gone for the crayfish, the colder. This is seafood cooked super simply, so it's letting the seafood shine. This has just been done on the barbecue. I've chucked lemon over the top, some beautiful roe there. Oh man. It's so juicy and succulent. Wow, that is good. This here, one of my favorite fish. So flounder or pātiki. It's a bottom dweller and it has got the most beautiful, um, delicate flesh. I can tell before I've even eaten it that it's perfectly cooked because it is so delicate and juicy. Mm. Oh. Super sweet, 
a very subtle flavor. Wow, got to get into this fry bread. Look at that. So, as its name would suggest, it is deep fried bread. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. Damn delicious. Loaded fry with uh, creamed parla. Mm. We got two sides, so this other side is covered in seafood chowder. Oh man. Both of those are delicious. Both are very creamy. Mm. Oh, a good hit of the seafood in there too. Yum. And anything loaded onto fries, winning. Now, I'm absolutely eyeing up this muscle, sort of muscle sandwich, muscle burger. The mussels were just cooked straight on the hot plate, so super simple, big, juicy mussels, and then all just on a big piece of um, fry bread. Oh my God. Wow. And covered. That is so good. The um, the mussels are perfectly cooked. It's just like Sheena spoke about with the simple cooking, but perfectly cooked. So they've just gone on the hot plate and they are super tender, super juicy. There's none of that chew you can get if you overcook a mussel. Oh man, they're delicious. And the fry bread, look how it's taken on all the liquid as well. So it's just drenched and soaked and juicy with liquid. They're good. I've dunked some of the fry bread in the creamed power. So power is abalone, like a real luxury, a, a special thing, not something we get to eat very often. And this is, it's cream. So it's just done in basically cream and power, like crazy good combo. Oh man. Oh, it's so good. Could you get a little seafoody hit from the power you get a heavy dairy hit from the, the cream the bread is, is essentially a bread donut so you get the that sort of deep fried feel but it's not oily at all like, there's nothing on my fingers from that bread and i love that sometimes donuts fry bread and stuff can be way too oily this just isn't oh my word that is such a good tub of, of cream power and the fry bread is crazy good. I think someone wants some. Oh man, that is so good. Mm. Juicy, sweet scallops. Mm -hmm. Really good. Zadie Baby's going a little bit nuts because she's had a taste of this pataki, the flounder, and is loving it. You know what I also love? about this place is just the vibes it's really great vibes obviously incredible food the seafood is cooked to perfection it it's done simply they let the seafood shine but the team is awesome it's like a fun place to dine everyone's got a massive smile, smile on their face it's pretty early so it's not even 11 o'clock yet and there's already a queue forming it's gonna get mad here this hour i reckon oh i can see why like sheena said the vibes here are awesome the queue's starting to form it's early everyone's just happy everyone's got stacks of food <laughs> like everyone's loving it like life is good and i've now got that cheeseburger covered in the cream power to try and I'm fizzing. Oh. I've gone hands deep on the double cheeseburger covered in cream power. Oh whoa. Whoa. How are you? Okay. Oh man. If I was covered in it before. I'm really covered in it now. That is a all-encompassing eating experience. The cheeseburger is super simple, like smash patty, cheese, some barbecue sauce as well in there, and then that you get that super creamy taste and the power taste. That thing is wild. 
far out. That is cool. I sort of, I can't put it down now. I've just got to go hard. That is so fun. Look at this place. It's such a cool setup. The food's amazing. And like, where else can you eat that? Look at that thing. Oh, oh, and this is a fry bread bun too. So there's all the slightly smaller fry breads for dipping and stuff. And then they make even bigger fry breads for the buns for their, their burgers. So all the burgers come on the fry bread bun. Insane. It is insane. This is such a fun eating experience. It is wild. The food is sensational. It has been a really long time since we've been on your screens. This is the first video back in months and months and months. You've noticed we've got a new team member, Zadie, our daughter, nine months old. It's great to be back. I could not have a, a cheeky spoonful of the um, steamed pud and custard, which I don't think we've even mentioned yet. We've got classic steam pudding, drenched in custard. Whoa, yeah. Just adds to the delicious creaminess of this meal. Mm. What a way to finish. Not that we're even close to finish. We're going to chow down, taking a whole lot home for, for second lunch, dinner. What a feast. Hope you've enjoyed this one. Drop a comment down below if you've enjoyed it. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you've enjoyed it. Thanks heaps for watching. We'll see you on the next one.